Hey guys, Pastor Rob here. I'm going to dive right in with this question. Have you ever wrestled with the idea of how can I be myself when the world around me is telling me that myself is not good enough? I have. And I want to answer the question by telling you a cool story. There's a story in the Bible about a guy named David. And even if you have not been around churches or you haven't even read the Bible, there's a good chance that you've heard the story of David and Goliath. So basically, there's this giant named Goliath, and he is yelling and taunting this army of people saying, I want to fight you. I want to try to take you out. I want to give anybody a chance to come and try to defeat me. You know, when I hear that statement from the giant, I immediately think of this very question. Because sometimes when I I think of how can I be myself, it feels like a giant because I don't even know really who myself is. And so how can I be myself if I don't even know who I really am? And when I think about that, it feels like a giant just taunting me and taunting me, just like Goliath did to David. So David gets to the giant and he hears this taunting of, hey, you want to come try to take me down? Bring it on. Let's go. And David looks at Goliath and he says, you know what? I I can do something about this. I could kill this giant. So he goes to the commander of the army. His name was Saul. And he says, Saul, I want to take out the giant. And Saul goes, dude, no way. Like you're this little boy. This guy is a giant. There's absolutely no way that you could take him out. And David's like, no, really, I I can do it. I can, I can take him out. Let me do it. And so finally he convinces Saul to let him do it. But Saul says, all right, if you're going to do that, that's fine. But here, you've got to put on my armor, take my helmet, take my shield, take my breastplate, my sword, my faith, and and all that kind of stuff. Take everything that I have and, and you put that on and then go try to fight that giant. So Saul loads the, the kid up, right? Like just loads him up. And the Bible says that once he's all loaded up, David can't even walk. He's got all of this stuff on him and it's so overwhelming to him that he can't even walk. You know, I don't know about you, but I can see a comparison with that in my life as well. You see, because oftentimes when I don't feel like myself is enough, I try to throw all of these different things on me. The things that I think the world around me wants me to be. Whether it's a really funny personality, whether it's a a really caring person, or, or a guy that looks a certain way, or a guy that dresses or acts or talks a certain way. And so I try to become that thing. I try to have that trait. And I put all of this stuff on top of me, and all of a sudden, I can't even move anymore in my life because I've put all of this stuff from everyone else on that my own self can't even move from it. That's exactly what happened to David. Saul throws all this armor on him to try to defeat this giant. And David says, I can't even move. And so here's what David did. He took all the stuff off. He took off the helmet. He threw down the sword and the shield, the breastplate, the the shoes, and, and all the armor that Saul tried to throw on him. He's like, get this off of me. I'm gonna go with the thing that God has given me. And he picks up this sling. Now think of a slingshot, right? So he's got this little slingshot. He's got a few rocks and he says, I can't wear that armor. I'm gonna go with what I've got for myself. I'm gonna go with what God gave me. And so he picks up his slingshot and he goes after this giant. Now, if you don't know this story, it's pretty awesome. He takes one rock, swings it around, throws it at the giant, hits the giant in the head, and the giant's dead. Now, why is that such a cool story? Because the reason David defeated the giant wasn't because he was trying to be who everyone else wanted him to be. It was because he was living in who God created him to be. You know, if you want to be yourself, and and find out how to be yourself in a world that is constantly telling you you're not enough, the best thing that you can do is take off all the things that you think the world wants you to be and be who God made you to be. Because then you can defeat the giant. So 
How have you defeated the giant in your life? How have you moved from a place of feeling like you weren't good enough to feeling like what you had from God was more than enough? I'd love to hear it in the comments below. Or if you've got a question, you want to know more about how you can get rid of the armor and the different things that the world is telling you to put on, leave it in the comments below. I'd love to engage with you about it. Or maybe you've got a question that you want us to ask. I want to hear it. I want to answer it. So be sure to, to leave us a comment. Be sure to subscribe. Be sure to share the video so that we could keep building the community that we have going on here. Thanks, guys. Catch you later. Thank you.